YouTube. Okay, I'm gonna Not me, Trayvon Knight, new employee. Yes, employee sir. Of the month. yes sir. Yes, sir. Employee of the month, man. What you do, man? I birthed out uh, three, the dogs. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. Birthed out a, a Brindle. Uh huh. Brindle. And. Uh, Lilac. Yeah. Say it. Go ahead and say it. So they know you know. Hmm? Say it. Let me hear you say it. I don't know who you said. What is the brown one? What is what is uh, the dog y'all got? I'm gonna name it Milo. Milo. Oh, Milo. I mean, but what is the what is the color of the dog? Oh, it's a uh, brown brown dog. Lilac. 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 All right, lilac. Lilac. Dog. Lilac. Yes. Lilac, lilac. We, we in there. We teaching them, man. We teaching them, man. Yeah, yeah. But where Thor at? Point at Thor for me. Thor's about uh, right there. That's uh Big okay team. okay. So where a bear at? A bear. No, a bear. I believe bear right there. You gotta look. I just. You pointed at this one? That's not a bear. Nigga, I said the bear. Oh, all right, the bear. bottom one. All right, all right, all right. Just making sure you know, man. Just making sure you know. And what's what's our kennel name, man? Nice kennel. You know, subscribe, turn the post notifications. Huh? Like, like. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Go check that camera and see how that camera looks. But yeah, Night Kennel family, I got you, babe. But yeah, Night Kennel family, look at the setup. We got the whelping box right here in the corner. We got the box right here, so when Callie used the bathroom, we just put the pups inside there. We got a heating lamp to go over top. No, heating pad is inside. Heating pad is inside. We got the food over here for Callie. Whenever she wants to go out and eat, she can. We got this right here, so she can't get out of this area. It's just her area, so nobody can bother. She just, it's her area. Think we doing pretty good for our first letter, man. Ooh, that one close to my feet. Mamanasia delivered the pups. I was at work. She did her job. There they go, Kelly, behind you if you wanna. Tell them how was the experience on your on your delivery. Experience delivery is pretty cool. Scary at first. She just let the first one drop and then walked away from it. So I had to pop the um sack, sack off mm -hmm. of it or whatever. But I mean, Callie did her thing for the most part. If anything, she wasn't licking them as soon as they came out. I just passed them to her. She did what she had to do. Yep. Just like that. Callie, you really got to take care of these dogs. Yep, but man, that's what we doing, man. We, I think we doing a pretty good job for our first litter. This is the pit bull litter. Honey, Thor just be doing too much. Come over here with your mom. They look great, man. They look great. Right Welcome, Knight's Kennels. Night Kennel family. Man, we just giving y'all another update, man. Pups is looking amazing. Excuse Nani in the background. She mad because she in the cage right now. She keep messing with Callie when she trying to feed her pups. But yeah, man, this is what we got going on. Day three. Likes to be done. We've been up all night. Each night we've been up watching these pups. Just making sure they, they eating, making sure they sleep good, making sure they warm enough. It's a full-time job, man, but we doing what we got to do. You see Mama Naja right here doing her part, doing her due diligence to make sure they good. But yeah, Mama Naja, can you tell us what you're doing right now? Right now, we're just putting them on each each one, making sure they have a nibble or whatever. Yeah. Or whatever. Making sure they're all getting fed at the same time. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's hard for all of them to get fed because it's seven. She only got five nipples on one side. Um, can you tell us what you think about the pups? They're amazing. Yeah. It's what all... we create around here. Yes, sir. Nothing but pressure. You see each pup. Each pup look good, man. No pup look strawny. No pup look like they sucked out. They all look good. All seven. Yeah, if you are going to have a pregnant dog or a nursing dog or whatever, make sure your mom is well fed. Make sure she got water. Make sure you give her at least like 10 minute breaks from them because she'd be really tired. But heavy on the food. Like if you can, you got to go out to the store and buy them chicken. If you got to, you got to mix them with wet puppy food. A lot of puppy food, high in calories. For them to get their weight back, cause the, these little puppies is really like taking a lot out of them. Yes. Like, look how these niggas are sucking on it. Whole tongue on there. Whole tongue, guapped around. Look, 
old tongue wrapped around that. That's one. Kilo, by the way. That's Kilo, the lilac. What's that one in your hand? What's that one in? This one right here. That? that is Bonnie. That's Bonnie. Oh, no, no, no. No, that's no. Clyde. I don't know which one this is. That might be Clyde. Actually, it is Clyde, yeah. Yeah, that's Clyde. Because that's Thor right here. Yeah, Thor is the biggest one. Thor might be sold already. We don't know yet. Waiting for the deposit, but yeah, man, this is what we doing here at Night's Kennels. Actually, today we're about to head out for a little bit and see how she takes care of them by herself. Hopefully she do good because every time they cry, she do go for them and make sure she provides them with what they need. Or she'll like lean her stomach over some more so making sure they can eat. Yep. So. And we got the, we got the camera above just to make sure we watch them. Keep an eye on him. Damn, Make look at that sure handsome man right there. Stuff. Look at that handsome man. But yeah, man, that's what we doing at Night's Kennels. Cause you gotta let him get in there. Producing yeah, some some fun. great quality pits, man. These are great quality pits. Full tails, big heads like they bullies. Man, this is beautiful, man. Sometimes you got to lead the puppies to Callie. Well, to your dog, your nursing moms, to make sure she cleans them up. Yes. She has to clean their butts. Yes, because... And when she clean them, you'll notice sometimes they're shit because she... That's how they shit. They, when she lick, they start shit. When she lick, they shit. Yes. The lick shit process. But also another tip for you guys, dropping knowledge. When y'all do this... The couple days, like or like a week or so, make sure you wear gloves. Make sure you wear gloves. Because that scent might irritate the mom, and she might mess around and eat one of them because she don't like the scent that's on them. So just make sure you wear gloves, man. Just be safe, man. Just be safe. You but should yeah, trust man. you if that's your owner, but yeah. we ain't chance it yet just because... But, like, she let us do the whole shebang. She ain't never grow out of us. She'll listen to us when we tell her to come out and stuff. And we put the puppies up for a little bit. But. And one thing I'm happy about the most is Callie is a great mom. Outstanding mom. Her job she doing right now, she making sure she take care of them. She making sure all of them safe. And she been up countless hours just making sure they are, like, she haven't even been wanting to go outside, really, because she want to make sure they're safe. But, well, yeah, this is Thor right here. This might be my favorite boy. I'm not going to lie, man. He the biggest of the batch, the first one that came out. And he going to be pressure when he get older. That's, uh, I believe, that is Bonnie. I mean, that, yeah, that's Bonnie, I think. Is that Bonnie? Yep. Yep, that's Bonnie. And, uh... A beer right here. A beer is right here. This is one that's staying in the family. Can you show a little close up real quick? That is a bear. Brindle boy. Big noggin on him. Full tail. It's a beauty, man. This is a beauty what we doing over here, man. Callie and Bruno, man. It's a good match. That pedigree match well. Like, we didn't think we was going to get this, but... Thank God we did, man. Look at that lilac. Look at that boy. Some pressure. Stitch says, show me. And Stitch didn't even want um the lilac get no love, man. He didn't want um Kilo get no love. But yeah, man, this is what we doing over here, man. Just sometimes when we don't use the heating blanket, we got like a little blanket from Walmart. Three dollar blanket, so invest in these little blankets. Yes. But it is also a cushion underneath the tarp. And then I got like a ten dollar heating pad right underneath, so they have like a little hot spot. But most of their heat gonna come from Cali. I didn't want to put this down while we leave because they can get underneath of it and it's really hot. And so, you can adjust the temperature with these little heating pads. Yeah. We got the heating pad right now and I got it on high you actually. Show, you show the little it's like high low. It's a little dirty. Chill off for that. A little dirty, but she good. Get the job done. Yeah, but I gotta go out and get some more Clorox wipes to wipe this down. This is the other one we got. We gotta wash that. This is the heat and blanket. Heat and blanket. Really man. nice for at nighttime, especially because we have the air on because it's summertime. So you gotta like. Oh, I'm crying, Kelly. 
See, she gets right to the job. You tell her, she gets right to it. Right just to like it. That. Right to it. Just like that, man. That's a great mom. Anyways, what I was saying. Um. Yeah, most of the heat come from the mom. You don't want to overheat the mom because she's already stressing out from the pups eating at her. So. That's another thing, man. Make sure you feed the mom. Like, make sure you give her an amount that you usually don't give her. Big amounts because a like, lot. She's she's very hungry, especially before she went in labor. They do not eat for 24 hours. So when it's time for her to eat again, make sure you, like, bust it down. Like I said, chicken from the store, boil it real quick. Add some rice with that. You can even add the dog food, the wet dog food, whatever. Whole shebang. Make them a whole mixture of something crazy. Just right. make sure they eating. Make sure they got frequent outsides and breaks to use the bathroom and stuff. Yep. Because right now she working. She work all night long. All day long. Yep, she doing her best, man. She doing her best. Ain't that right, Callie? Ain't that right, Callie? You doing your best, girl. Good job, Moss. Yeah. Yeah, she ain't camera shy right now. But yeah, man, this is what we doing over here. Really, I just want to move them all to her. Got Clyde over there chilling by herself. Bonnie over there. She just moved Bonnie. Well, no, that's not Bonnie. That's uh, a, bear. a bear. Yeah, we're going to just keep Thor right here. Cause Thor, Thor, man. Thor shape. is my boy, he yo. Thor look just like Cali, but more size. He's going to be healthy. Whoever put their hands on him, grab him. He's going to be a good stud for your, for your breedings, man. But yeah, man, this is what we doing. This is what we doing. We're going to keep elevating. We're going to keep grinding. Just more success, more blessings, man, to come. Look at Callie leaning over so she can make sure she give all the nipples to the pups. I just What I do sometimes, I just make sure I throw them all on her so they can get her heat and stuff. They'll move when they want to, but that's on them. So she'll reposition them whenever she feels as though they're crying and stuff like that. And these is only three day old pups. And look how beautiful they are, man. Look at the quality. Look at that brindle. I don't like brindles, but a bear make me like brindles. That patch on the head, that white on the neck. I don't think this is too cool for me. Gotta love it. It should be all right. They got Cali right here. Yeah, that's why I'm with this heating patch. I want them to go in front of her, but a bit and that Thor always love to go back in that corner. Yeah, I know. There's something about that corner. Go ahead and put that down right there. What up, Night Kennel family? Right now, we in track to Chicago. Looking for Dine. Dine and Sports Mix for sports our mix. puppy food, but they do not got that shit as usual. Nope. Nope. Where they Dine usually be at? We're in the track to supply. Where's the puppy food supposed to be at? Only he knew. Last time I called, she had to uh, get it from the back. So they might got it in the back. Uh, yeah, this one. This what we feed our um our dogs the sports mix, but usually we get the uh, puppy kind for uh Nani. But we're not even gonna lie, we started off with Cali. She had diamonds, naturals. We can show you all that. That's down this way. Her energized up and stuff. She should be good. So we got the dime. Check the dime. Right, we're gonna go look and we see how much one, this gallon is just to see how we gonna do this. Bring it out. This drawing nice right here. We might get that when we get our own little spot so the pups can play outside. But yeah, man, that's what we doing. We're gonna track the supply right now, looking for what we need. So with the big jug, I think we're going with this. $70. I think we're going with this, guys. $70? We're going with this. And then when we really start, if they start using this a lot, then we'll go with this. This 70 ball? Excuse me, Night Kennel family. I had to cut the vid short because when I seen that price, man, my head went crazy. My head started spinning. I had to get out of the store, man. I dropped everything and left, man. No cap. But anyways, I love y'all, Night Kennel family. Thanks for showing love. Thanks for showing the support. If y'all showing it, and man, we're going to keep striving. We're going to keep elevating. And we're we going to continue to count our blessings and be grateful, man. Love y'all.